was me, I swear. I grabbed the right bag. The right bag! Okay, maybe not the right bag. I just needed a piss! Oh, you needed a piss, did you? Listen, the bags look similar. That was the fucking point! What? We used identical bags so that no one would know that anything was missing. It was such a simple fucking plan, boys! You know what? I knew he was going to be trouble. Well, maybe if we didn't give a gun to someone who's basically been in and out of prison since he was in nappies, I might have been able to focus a bit better. You know that we had no action at the robbery. This gun still has a full clip. <laughs> didn't mean anything by it. Oh, fuck. Why'd you bring him on this job? I heard he built a meth lab underneath a primary school. Meth? No, meth. It wasn't meth. It's not a gram of weed here in my asshole. Besides, you need the fear factor to make a job run smoothly. He was the perfect fit. But he's too much. He's a psychopath. Well, he was more of a fucking asset to the job than you were, wasn't he, dickhead? Now we're all on this shit show together because of your fucking mistake, not his. Maybe remember that next time. <laughs> this one time. <laughs> On this guy's first job with me. He thought it'd be a good idea to put petrol in the diesel fucking getaway car. <laughs> 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 Yeah, yeah. Apart from your piss. I checked. <laughs> we got ourselves another member. We we're only meant to go 40%, 40%, and 20%. Wait, who's, who's the 20? Oh, you, who do you think? 20%? I was the one that stole the bloody bag. You're an amateur, why would you get equal to us? You're one step off being this thing here. 20% is good. You're worth 20% and you'll shut your fucking mouth with your 20%. <laughs> You're hardly worth 40% yourself. Your mouth alone earns you about half of that. You know, you've had a problem with me ever since the boss promoted me over you and left you as a fucking foot soldier of the gang. Didn't he? Hmm? Yeah. Like you could amount to anything else. Oh, so you have the utmost respect for the boss, do you? So much as you wanted to steal 50,000 from him this morning, hey? Could get you killed. Maybe lose your job. Well, we're all in this shed together now, aren't we? And you've got to be fucking joking if you don't think I wouldn't pass the blame of my mistake onto a fucking foot soldier like you. Or especially a criminal wannabe trying to get into the game. I could fuck both your lives up. Do you understand me? You'll be on the run for the rest of your measly fucking lives. Cause... Did I say something funny, did I? You're gonna make me angry in a minute. 
Ooh, make him angry. And what's that supposed to fucking mean? Right. Think I am! I suggest you make a move now. You're in no place to have a life like this, so we will stick to steel. You stay out of my head. Perfect. Oh, I'll never do anything like this again. For your sake, Count for mine. I mean. This life isn't for you. I hope to never see you again. Waiting for you outside. You've never had a life, man. It's what got me in this game in the first place. Never had a stable family, never had a stable job. Dealing a bit of weed behind a biology block was my first source of income. I'm not actually a horrible person. Just... Just sometimes... Bad things need to be done to get the job done. Sometimes bad things need to happen to get the job done. I've heard all that shit before. Yeah, it's me. Yeah, I got the money. <laughs> yeah. No, I know it took me a while. All right? They tie me up. Nah, nah, nah. Like a child doing their shoelaces for the first time. <laughs> all right. Yeah. Oh, give me one second. Yeah, it says 50 grand. No, you need to take care of one. Nah, they took care of the rest of themselves. Alright, just make sure the car's there, alright? 